to Catholic News World. St. John the Apostle and Evangelist. The patron of authors, burns, poisoning, theologians, publishers, booksellers, editors, friendships, and painters. St. John was the son of Zebedee and Salome, and the brother of James the Greater. In the Gospels the two brothers are often called after their father the sons of Zebedee and received from Christ the honorable title of Boanerges, meaning sons of thunder. Originally they were fishermen and fished with their father in the lake of Genesareth. They became, for a time disciples of John the Baptist, and were called by Christ from the circle of John's followers, together with Peter and Andrew, to become his disciples. John was the younger of the two brothers. John had a prominent position in the apostolic body. At the Last Supper his place was next to Christ on whose breast he leaned. John alone remained near his beloved master at the foot of the cross on Calvary with the mother of Jesus and the pious women, and took the desolate mother into his care as the last legacy of Christ. After the resurrection John with Peter was the first of the disciples to hasten to the grave and he was the first to believe that Christ had truly risen. John was called the disciple whom Jesus loved in his The Gospel of John. Peter and John healed the lame man in the temple in the book of Acts 3. John and Peter were thrown into prison in Acts 4. John went for the first time to Asia Minor and exercised his apostolic office in various provinces there. He returned with the other disciples to Jerusalem for the Apostolic Council in about AD 51. John wrote epistles and the Apocalypse. The Apocalypse tells us that its author was on the island of Patmos. According to Tertullian, St. John was banished after being plunged into boiling oil in Rome and suffering nothing from it. It is said that all in the audience of Colosseum were converted to Christianity upon witnessing this miracle. He is said to have lived to old age, dying at Ephesus probably in AD 100. Please subscribe to Catholic News World's YouTube channel. Thanks and God bless.